Hello, it's Caleb Waller, Ashen Clone, and you know what it's time for, the big surprise. I've been planning this video for months, and don't forget people, if you've read the title of this video, this is only part one. Part one. So imagine what's going to be in part two, so you know what to do, subscribe and stay tuned. But anyway, enough of that. You've seen the teaser videos, you've waited patiently, and now it's time to reveal at least half of the big surprise. Congratulations to those of you who are watching, you've just made gaming YouTube history. Now, follow me into my room where I will show you something very, spe very, very special. Let's go. Okay guys, the moment of truth is here. Now, I'm going to go towards the box. It's inside the box. God, I, I'm so nervous of showing you this, but I just hope that you're going to like the reaction. Ready? Hang on a minute. Sorry about this. Where is everything? I mean, that is just bubble wrap. <sighs> Sorry about this, guys. I've done this about two takes already. One minute. Uh, let me just... Oh, wow! Here they are. From the box onto the bed. Yes! Here they are. This is half of my Nintendo Game & Watch collection. Now, the surprise already, and without even showing you any of this, is that a little known fact is that I do collect Nintendo Game & Watch games. And guess what, people? What you're seeing here, every single one of these games are all brand new, never been used, with a retail of, I'd say, at least $500 a piece. I've been collecting these for a few years now and this is only half of the story so that's why you're going to need to subscribe and stay tuned for part two coming soon but anyway enough of that let's get started and let me show you this fantastic collection of game and watch games and chipsters I hope you're watching this because I know you're going to love this video so let's go one by one and show you what I exactly what I have Nintendo Game & Watch Oil Panic Multi-Screen Brand new, never been used. Well, they're all brand new, never been used. Pristine condition. Multi-Screen series. Definitely one of the better games in the whole lot. Donkey Kong Jr. Nintendo Game & Watch Wide Screen. These are what the wide screen games look like and this is the uh, exact game of Donkey Kong Jr. Blackjack. One of the less rarer titles, but to find it in brand new condition is absolutely amazing. Um, another multi-screen series version, never been used. Um, I'd like to point out one thing before I continue. Due to the rarity and the fact that I don't have time to open all the boxes, please don't write comments saying these are just empty boxes. I mean, these are all original, real the real deal basically so I please don't want to see any comments saying oh these are just empty boxes because they do contain everything in them I and mean, you can hear that rattling those are the batteries but they do contain everything in them they're not empty boxes at all so just because I don't have enough time and they're so rare and I don't want to keep opening the boxes to show you these things so you either believe me or you don't so I'd just like to point that out before I continue because I won't be opening any of these games up the uh, very rare and I can't open this particular game up anyway because it's still sealed mega mega rare that's all I can say about this particular version the Otto Nintendo Italian sticker sealed on both sides and this is the pinball version which is another multi-screen series game very very rare indeed sealed on both sides you'll never ever see another one of these in a million years Zelda, definitely one of my favourite Game & Watches. Another multi-screen series, one of the more popular titles that seem to become more and more collectible. Brand new, never been used. This one is the, uh, well it's in the pocket size series which is a bit rarer but they only did not make the pocket size version for this particular game. Has the barcode and then if we look closely at the actual screenshot of the game 
you'll be able to see you'll be able to see it's sort of retro 80s Zelda gameplay very fascinating as I thought they always started the uh, Zelda series on the Game Boy obviously not take a break from that side for a minute and let's go on to this side Game & Watch Gold series, one of the more original series let me just reposition the camera right uh, an old yen Japanese sticker from the shop brand new never been used helmet um, these ones fetch a lot of money the gold series they only made three so I have all three of them brand new in the boxes um, definitely one of the more rare titles to find because they're more older early 80s we've got Lion it's very similar gameplay very simplistic as it was one of the first Game & Watch series um, Japanese writing on the back just basically telling you how to take open the battery cover and we've also got manhole as well and you can see it's got an alarm function they all do but uh, again very nice example of Game & Watches Super Mario Brothers one of the more popular titles still very rare in this condition nonetheless brand new um, more simplistic gameplay there very um, basic minimal gameplay you're going to see on these very rare fascinating handhelds again one of the ones that have the barcode more later version um, yeah we all know what Mario is one of the mega 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 rare titles to collect this was the last game and watch made in 1991 so believe it or not yes when the Game Boy was out in the NES and almost when the SNES was came out 1991 they were still making Nintendo Game & Watches and this was their very last model but believe it or not it's the actual one of the rarest versions one of the rarest models and games in the series again because it's very recent it's got a barcode this gameplay looks a lot different compared to the ancient ones found on helmet lion and so and so because it was more recent looks a bit like a color screen um, but it's still the same it's still a Game & Watch very rare to find this in brand new condition I can tell you this will probably fetch close on a thousand dollars brand new Mario's Cement Factory widescreen Game & Watch and then we've got Manhole not very special the game itself this was featured in one of them classic 80's film I can't remember the title of but anyway brand new as you can see shiny shiny um, game. None of these games are reproductions, they're all originals. I've been um they've been deemed authentic by a collector I know who lives about an hour away from here, my house. Supercolor series. Called Supercolor because they've got a large screen compared to the other ones and they've actually got it sort of looks like a colour screen even though it isn't technically it is. But it's an L C D game nonetheless. This one's called Crab Grab and Spitball Sparky, they only made two of these in the series very rare to find in this condition and I like the fact it's got a silver chrome casing, makes it look very fashionable and over here we've got Balloon Fight again with a barcode, very simplistic gameplay another brand new never been used version where was we up to? Ah, the original starter of them all of the multi-series, Donkey Kong 1 again a very popular title this is pristine condition and it's a first edition box because it's got nothing written on the back one of the very first models DK52 simplistic gameplay these are very high in demand at the moment in collectors hands Donkey Kong 2 as well we've got again the same shows pictures on the back Bomb Sweeper and Safe Buster, which are both in the Pocket series, but again they only made this as the Pocket series versions. Same with Safe Buster. Simplistic gameplay, and then this one's interesting. It's called Gold Cliff. One of the first ones to feature a continue feature. Very interesting, and again the Pocket series got a little mark there, but it's still brand new, never been used. Turn the box over. So there you have it, guys. Join me for part two very soon. Thanks for watching, guys. Take care.